Hi guys, it's Dina with Tally Decor and I wanted to show you guys how I dehydrate my rose petals. And right now, I had done some already. I did the yellow and I did my red roses. Right now I have white roses in the oven and pink roses and red ones. Hold on, I'll show you guys what it looks like. Here I have my pink rose petals and my red ones that I already took off the stem. And here I have my, my white rose petals. These are almost done. They have been in the oven. It's 200 degrees. They've been in the oven for like 15 minutes now. And I think they're going to be done in like two minutes. Liam is home from school today. We're having some bad weather here in New Jersey, another snowstorm. I think it's already six inches outside and it's already 10.01. It's only 10.01 a.m. So Liam's online, Layden is in the playroom, he's watching TV. My husband just had to go to work and I'm praying that he's safe on the streets out there. It's really, really nasty. Let me see if I can flip the camera around so you guys can see what it looks like outside. Look at that. So nasty out here. But it's pretty. What are you doing? Okay. Go learn, child. Go learn. So, and there's the other little monkey. <laughs> I just took the white roses out of the um, rose petals out of the oven. And you can tell they look a bit yellowish, but that's okay. Um, it is what it is. There is nothing I can do about it. It's natural. But you can tell the difference between the white and the yellow. I just took these out of the oven. They are not ready yet, but I just wanted to show you guys what they look like. You have to take it out and like shake it up a bit so they don't get stuck. Like this one was stuck. But it's okay. Stick them back in. These rose petals I use in my wax molds, in my Love Spell wax molds, and um, some some different candles that I'm messing around with. Lee, are you done? Break. Your break time? Okay. So Liam's having his break right now. You want to come say hi? And that's Liam. I think they're ready to come out. Here they are. Just feel them. They all feel pretty good by crispy-ish. And we don't want it to be like this one. This one doesn't it doesn't feel as good, so we're gonna stick it back in the oven for maybe like another four minutes. Once you can shake it like this, it's good in my opinion. And there you have it. I have my dehydrated rose petals that I will be using in my wax molds. Guys, if you like this content, can you please consider liking and subscribing? It will truly help me out a lot. Thank you.